Welcome back to North of the Broad. With me now is Mara Conley. She is the Communications and Events Coordinator for the Pat Conroy Literary Center, and she's here specifically to talk about the camp that is going to be going on this summer. Build a book. Build a book. Build a book. So the two weeks are June 17th through the 28th. That's correct. And the, the two weeks are divided according to different topics or different no, the whole, activities? No, the whole theme of the camp is called garbage. <laughs> and um, it's garbage with the four R's, and the students will choose what the four R's are, but okay. it's going to be reuse, renew, recycle, okay. repurpose, but it's making the world a better place. Okay, um, it. And it's a two-week camp, and the, um, it's going to be held at Beaufort Middle School. Right. And it's eight to four. Mm -hmm. um, and the first week, the children will be producing all of the work. They actually build this book. So when you say produce, when you say building it, to, to give me drill that down a little bit, what exactly will they be doing? They'll be doing all of the writing, the composition, the poetry, the photography, the artwork, um, developing the thematic structure. They do it all. And does each child do their own, or each student do their own camp or have their own book, or, is it, or do they work in groups? They work in groups. It's 8 to 11 and 12 to 15. We'll split oh, the age, ages up. Each child, though, will produce two pages in the book, and then it comes together as probably in the end it's going to be about a 62-page book. It will be published, bound. Um, oh. Yeah, it's going to be pretty. So the first week is producing the book, okay. and then the second, second week is going to actually be putting it together, I building see. it. And so how many students or campers do you have? In the, can right now sign we have, up? last year we had nine. Yes. Seven of them are returning. We have 27 signed up right now oh, for this wow. year. You're yes. kidding. No. And there's still said, room? it's going to be at Beaufort Middle School. Right. We'll have one room dedicated to um, art and the second room dedicated to writing and composition. So talk to me about, or to us, about who all is helping out who, the, with the students and doing the teaching and doing the coordinating. And we have two other teachers beside myself, Miho Kinnis, who is a published haiku author, and Lisa Ann Cullen, who is a published children's book author. Um, they both helped out last year. But we are also going to get four teaching assistants, which are going to be honor students from Beaufort High School. Um, there will be two visiting artists that will come in and help us. And um, so it's going to be a cooperative effort. Very it's cool. Be kind of and I understand you're going to have two field trips. We are. So where can you share where they're going to be going? Yes, the first field trip will be to Hunting Island. Okay. And um, we will just be hiking, looking at the natural beauty of the, mm. the island, nice. getting some ideas for artwork. Yes. Um, and then the second field trip, actually, Coastal Discovery Museum will come to us. Okay. And we're going to dye t-shirts indigo dye, which really has nothing to do with building a book, but it's a nice little respite for the kids. <laughs> That's great. Now, I understand the students will actually be critiquing each other's work. So explain a little bit That's more about that. That's a very, now. very important part of the yes. whole co-op, you know, creative process is after each day with the kids have created their piece, pieces, mm -hmm. they will sit down and it's a helpful critique. A, const a constructive, a constructive crit yeah. critique. Right. Critique. And uh, it's great. The kids give their feedback Feed to one another. I love and that. Yeah. Well, so. that's kind of part of life, too, is exactly. learning from each other and, and the importance of positive feedback. Right. And then so. coming back with a better product. Right. Exactly. So. That's the yeah. whole purpose. Now, the ending of the camp, there's like a celebration, I understand. So what does that involve? All right. So at the end of the camp, we'll, we will be ferreting the kids and all of their work here to the center, and we will have a final exhibit. Um, where all of the children's artwork will be on display, compositions, and the kids will actually do readings of their work, their poems, some of their short stories, and all of the parents, grandparents, friends, mm -hmm. people that have sponsored some of these children right. will all be invited to, to come and listen. And uh, what is the date of that, Mara? That's the last day, Friday, June 28th, okay. and it will be probably, well, it will be 4 to 5.30. Okay. Here at, um, at here the at the center. Yes. Now, um, so excited about that. Uh -huh. Still room to, to sign up. But on June seventh, you have another exciting event. We Tell do. us about that. We have um, a cooking demo and storytelling event with Sally Ann Robinson. She's a Gullah diva cook from <laughs> Defusky Island, who also happens to be a former student of Pat's. Okay. She was Ellen in the Water Is Wide, but she will be here June seventh, five thirty to seven thirty. Um, seating is limited. Uh, $35 a person, right. but Sally Ann does, she, she gives a great <laughs> show. And the uh, fare that will be served will be crab cake, rice, and um, fried ribs. 
Oh my little goodness. samples, yes. So, so, um, so she'll be here. She'll be spe speaking about her life and her cookbook. And she lives on Tofusky Island. She loves lives on Tofusky Island. And this and is not her first book, right? She's no, written she several. Has, she has yeah. two oh, okay. two cookbooks out, um, and she also has a book of photography on life on Tofusky. Okay. So, yeah. okay, great. So we have about a minute left. Is there anything else you'd like to share about this beautiful center this summer? You know, just as we actually have, the, they're filling up quickly, but um, we have started book clubs. Um, That's Pat right. has written 12 books, and each month there is one book, this, and it's going in chronological yep. order. But last month was The Boo with John Worley, he right. critiqued it. This uh, tomorrow, actually, it's The Water is Wide. Right. And um, so, as I said, they really fill up quickly, so you need to sign up. But. And, you, and your website is the Pat Conroy Literary Center dot org. Right. And if you've not been on the website, it's one of the best websites <laughs> that I've great. ever been on. The navigation is wonderful. You know, great, great pictures, great narrative, uh -huh. great information to be able to find out about all these exciting events coming up here at the Pat Conroy Literary Center. Mara, thank you so much for all you do for this center and the community. And we'll see you next time on North of the Broad. Thank you, Robin.